And what exactly does she want from me? That's between you and me then. And I prefer to keep it that way. Don't worry about it. Maven's business dealings usually involve quite a bit of money for her people. Speaking of which, yes. Of course, you're pick. <laughs> you're smart as a whiplash. Keep doing right by us, and there's plenty more where that came from. Oh, we meet live. Okay, two hundred. It's not exactly a huge payment, I gotta tell you. However, we're getting to meet Maven Blackbriar. I don't want to keep Maven Blackbriar waiting, however, I do have a statue of a bee that I'm supposed to return to delve in, and I am so, very curious about that. Can I sell you this Queen Bee statue? I mean, why I thought to do that, I have no idea, but... Well, well, I was looking for this little beauty. Were you? If you happen to cross any other unusual trinkets like this, be sure to bring them to me. I promise it'll be worth the effort. There you go. This should cover it. Okay, 200. I gotta tell you, not really. I honestly think I would have been better off keeping it for my own collection. Because 200 is just, it's just not that much. I'm sorry, I don't want to sound ungrateful, but I am. If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. Uh, yes, I have coin, but I'm not particularly interested in any you seats. You some nerve coming unless... back here after what you did to Kirava. Yes, I have a lot of nerve. You would be advised to stay out of my way. Uh, unless I want a drink, of course. Is there something I can do for you? Uh, not right now, but thanks for asking. Uh, I'm, I'm looking for Maven Blackbriar. Is she around? Uh, maybe some light? Right, a private meeting. That does make sense. So you're the one. Hmm. You don't look so impressive. Well, that's kind of the point, isn't it? You're not supposed to look like a great thief. You're supposed to just be a great thief. I'm the best at what I do. How about we skip the cut? That's a bit rude. I am the best at what I do. Self-promotion is always a good thing, even if it's a bit of an exaggeration. Is that confidence I hear? Or is it arrogance? Strange how often they're confused. It's you have to understand. More like stretching it's the truth. It's been a long time since Brynjolf sent me anyone I can rely on. I, I understand that. I've met uh, some of the uh, guild and they don't seem to be doing an awful lot. You have no faith in the guild. Faith? I don't have faith in anyone. All I care about is cause and effect. Did the job get done and was it done correctly? There's no grey area. Uh, you won't have a problem with me. Where do I begin? Let's just get straight to it. Head to the Bannered Mare in White Run and look for Malus Machius. Malus He'll fill you in on all Machius. the details. Okay. Right. I... F how did you become allied with the Thieves Guild? Who runs the show at Honning Broomreader? Your name carries weight in Rift, and that's pretty much stating the obvious, isn't it? Is this rude? How did you become allied with the Thieves' Guild? The Blackbriar family has always been allied with the Guild. Our connections with the Empire and within Skyrim make for a perfect fit. I dare say the Guild owes its survival as much to my family as it does to its own people. Mm, fair enough. Why am I interested in... Honningbrew Meadery? Who runs the show at Honningbrew Meadery? He says with a flash of intuition. Some layabout named Sabion. Been a thorn in my side for the last few years now. Oh, this is going to be related to the reason you're sending me to Whiterun. That Honningbrew Meadery is right outside of Whiterun, isn't it? Yes, it is. So this Sabion is uh, more than just friendly competition, I assume. Not a day goes by that I don't regret letting Sabion get as far as he did. 
In only a few short years, he's taken that bile he calls mead to market and a chunk of my profits with it. I can't imagine where he found the gold to take it to market so quickly. And you probably want me to find out? So get rid of him and he's no longer a threat. Exactly. With Savion in prison, his meadery will be forced to close. Or dead. Then I swoop in and take over the place. Isn't dead no good enough? No more competition. Uh, why strike now? The Golden Glow estate job has undoubtedly interrupted the supply of honey I need to make my mead. Savion could use this interruption to his advantage and collect a larger share of the market. I can't have that. No, no, of, of, of course not. Uh, oh, that's blindingly obvious. Uh, but in which case then, now? Uh, I will be One more time, in case on I wasn't my way. Clear. You butcher this job, and you will be sorry. Uh, when you say butcher the job, you mean fail it. You don't mean if I kill anyone. You, you're. Please tell me you're not one of these pacifist types like Delvin. It does make my life a little bit more complicated. Have you been stood there for pretty much ever? Every time I come in here, you're just stood there looking gormless. Louis Letrush. Looking for work? I need someone to deliver a message to Sibby Blackbriar. Oh, that's the gentleman in prison. What sort of message? Ah, well, I recently approached Sibby Blackbriar about buying Frost, one of the finest breeding horses in Skyrim. He agreed to sell. I paid Sibby half the cost of Frost up front, but before he could deliver, Maven had him locked up. Sibby believes this exempts him from our deal. It does not. I want you to talk to Sibby for me. Then I want you to bring me Frost and the lineage papers that prove the horse's worth. You want me to steal a horse from the Blackbriars or from Sibby? But it's still a Blackbriar. Sounds easy. I'm not interested. Why is Sibby in jail? I know that. Why don't you tell Sibby yourself? I'm not exactly comfortable around guards or jails. Definitely Neither am I, mate. when associates of mine have been locked up. No, I'll meet you outside of town. Uh, yes, yeah, sure. Good man, you won't regret it. Head to the Rifton Jail and talk to Sibby. Get him to tell you where Frost and his lineage papers are and bring them to me outside Rifton. You'll be well paid for your time. Oh, that sounds really good, I'll yes. i you outside of town. Excellent. Yes, you should run off and meet me outside of town. I've no intention of running upstairs and talking to Maven Blackbrow. No, I'm not. No, yes, no, I'm off to the jail right now. Maybe I should go to the jail and talk to him. I mean, I mean... Basically, he wants me to find out where if the horse is from Sibby Blackbriar. But why would Sibby tell me? I mean, really? Why would he tell me? He wouldn't. But I could tell him that the gentleman in there is um, planning on paying someone to steal it. No doubt about it. The Thieves' Guild is back, and they've got Riften in their grip. Yes, we do. Okay. So, he was... <laughs> well, if it isn't my little problem solver... Yeah, right. I haven't quite found uh, the, the problem you're interested in. Can However... Can you gawk at me, or is this a social call? I was actually sent by Louis Latrush. Ah, and let me guess. He wants his horse. Well, that's going to be a bit of a problem. You see, I don't really outright own Frost. You don't own the horse, but you sold it to him. That is correct. You see, Frost belongs to the Blackbriar estate. Your mother. Technically, everything in the estate is owned by my mother, Maven. Okay. <laughs> my plan was to take the horse from our lodge and deliver it to Latrush at the stables. Obviously, that didn't exactly work out as I'd planned. Still, I don't want to cross Latrush. Tell you what. Steal the horse and deliver it, and you can have the second half of the payment. You know, I bet Maven would pay me even more for this information. I bet she bloody would. Sure, take advantage of the guy in jail. Okay, fine, I can make the deal sweeter. I obviously don't have anything here, but there's a hidden stash in the lodge. And I did manage to hold on to the key. Okay. Take it. Uh... I 
think we should go and have a word with Maven. Yes, I do. Um, you see, we, we got a choice here. We can do a job for a scruffy looking man that hangs around a bar and a son that is in jail. Or we can curry favour with one of the most powerful people in Riften, if not the most powerful person in Riften. Hmm. Difficult choice. Working at the Riften fishery is tough. If you've got the coin, you've got yes. the right place. Pull up a Pull seat. Up a you seat. need a new spiel. You definitely need a new spiel. Um. Sorry, I, I like to see the people I'm talking to. Shouldn't you be on your way to Whiterun? I will be. I'm just I'm just getting supplies together. Why is everyone in a rush all the time? Are you aware that there's a plot to steal Frost, who I believe is a horse you own? Don't tell me. Sibby and Louis Latrush? Yes. Well, Sibby is in jail, and Latrush is certainly welcome to try. My hired help is more than a match for him. He's actually, yeah, he's trying to pay me to do it. I'm obviously going to say no, of course. Really? Now that is interesting. Then you should know that Louis and I have a certain history. Tell you what, go along with his plans for Wait, now. The shabby I'll little man downstairs. Both, and when the time is right, I'll settle accounts with Louis. You want me? Wait, you want me to steal the horse anyway? Just go along with it. You and Louis, really? Seriously? I just, uh, I'm not, I just, nope, not seeing that. Snowing in white run. That seem. You approach as if you know us. You're stage. the guy I'm right. looking for. Then what do you want? Yes, you are. I bring an offer from the Thieves Guild. Yes, I've heard the Guild is rising back to power. An alliance would be most beneficial to both parties. I will consider the offer, but I'll have to discuss it with the other caravans. Okay, perhaps this will sweeten the deal. I have a satchel filled with moon sugar. Ah, moon sugar. I could smell it on you. I am pleased with this offer and accept. Okay. Take my word to the leaders of your guild and tell them we look forward to a prosperous and profitable future. If you happen upon any of our caravans in your travels, we'd also be more than willing to pay you a fair sum for any of your stolen goods. Yes, that is what I wanted to hear. Oh, brilliant. Why sell your goods in Skyrim? Haven't we already had this conversation? It's a time of war. It's a good time to sell, isn't it? An astute question, for we are far from home, and this is a cold, hard land. The wise trader finds the best opportunities, even if he must travel far to find them. Skyrim is a ripe opportunity indeed. My the dragons and the war thinking. have scared many other traders away, but for those dragons, rich, there is much profit to be made. Dra dragons, I. Give my regards to Tonilia. Tell her I'll contact her soon. I've no one dragon. Okay, so we've now got an option to sell you honor Khajiit with your stolen presence. goods to the Khajiit caravans. This is going to Many make life a lot easier friend. for me. How can I assist? Hmm? Um. I was actually hoping one of you would be a trader. Can you trade me? Uh, well, I, oh, wait a minute. Do I have an option to trade with you now? Oh, yes, I do. I do. Our transaction complete. Take a look. <gasps> right. So will you... Do I have to go back before you'll um, take any of my stolen goods yet? Is, is Yes, probably. Unless I have no stolen goods on me, and I don't believe that is the case. So I need to talk... Out of curiosity, are you okay with me? I know you're a recovering addict, and I, I, I realise that was probably a little uh, insensitive. You want to talk? I just want to know we're good. No, right now my I mind is a dried-up riverbed. Come and see what I offer. That's that's good. That's really yes. Not sure how that makes me feel, but uh, let, let's just move on and meet. 
Maven Blackbriar's contact. We do actually have one other thing to do here. I believe it's steal some specific item. I think it's jewellery. It's usually jewellery. In War Maidens, which of course is the blacksmith here. I wonder how good the blacksmith is here. I mean, I've now got access to a flawless one. Okay. I've now got access to a... F is she not around here? Is, is night falling? Night might be falling. Which actually would be Let perfect. Let me know if you see anything you like. Okay, who have we got in here? We've got a well, battle bomb. Traveler. Commander... Caius, do I need to speak to you? I don't think I do. Amrin? You know what's wrong with Skyrim these days? The snow. Oathbird war. Where, could, where is, um... Is she a wife? She a wife. Must be a Everything wife. Everything you see here was made with skill and care by my wife, Adrian. Where's your wife? I would like to speak to your wife and see if she could do a job for me. Welcome to War Maidens. Um, now don't let the name worry. Oh, we got no. plenty of steel for fighting. You're men. the person to speak to. Ah, right. What I just want to do is pick yeah. a random. I just want to see. I, I'm just curious as to how good she happens to be. So let's pick this one. And see what they do. Superior, not that good. Sorry, sorry. I'm I'm going to be keeping, I'm going to be keeping things to myself. It's it's nothing personal. You solder. Okay, no. Nope. Right. You look like someone who knows how to wield a weapon. Well, you've come to the right place. Terrible sales pitch because you're a terrible judge of people. Uh, I know how to wield a weapon. Basically, you hold the bit that's not sharp and pointy. Oh my god. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Oh, is this some of my... Oh, it's Let's my armor. See. It's my armor. Like that's it. Got to go. The annoying thing about this... I, I assume it's my armor. The annoying thing about this is... Um, the... Yes, notification note. Balamund. It is. It's the armor from Balamund. The problem is, is I'm going to actually have to give this to the new guildsmith to get him to turn it flawless. I don't know how much of a boost it is. And I think I will do my weapons first. This was a little bit of wasted money, but there you go. It's just how it is, I suppose. If you want the best, you have to pay for it. Or steal it, of course. That is another option. Right. I don't remember who on earth I'm looking for. It wasn't Hulda. It... I don't think it was you. I'm... Yes. No, it wasn't you, Greymane. Imar? Could it have been you? Malice is teaching me nope. everything he knows about brewing. Hopefully, I can take over his position someday. Malice Machius, or Macius. Can't a man drink in peace? Um, he can. He's just not going to right now because we have a job to do. Maven said you're expecting me. I'm gonna keep this short because we've got a lot to do. Haunting Brew's owner, Sabjorn, is about to hold a tasting for White Run's Captain of the Guard, and we're going to poison the mead. Ooh! Ooh! Ex you have the poison? No, no, that's the beauty of the whole plan. We're going to get Sabjorn to give it to us. The meadery has quite a pest problem, and the whole city knows about it. Pest poison? And mead don't mix well. You know what I mean? Oh. So you want me to take the pest poison and shove it in the mead, kill a lot of the people in the taster, and then he goes out of business. I like it. How do I fit in? I've answered my own question before I asked it, but I suppose I have no choice. How do I fit You're in? You're going to happen by and lend poor old Sabjorn a helping hand. Okay. He's going to give you the poison to use on the pests but you're also going to dump it into the brewing vat. Oh, so I don't even need to sort of sneak in. I just walk in and say, hello, I'm your new helper. Clever. Maven and I spent weeks planning this. All we need is someone like you to get in there and get it done. And by now someone like me, you mean someone grows a persuasive. Brain and hires someone else to do the dirty work. Okay, I already know where that is. Why are you doing all this? How do I get 
to the brewing. Why bother poisoning the nest for Sabion? So that people don't suspect it was me, I assume. Once Sabjorn is out of the way, Maven has plans for the place. Oh. One way or another, we don't want that. the pests coming back. Okay, yes, fair Consider enough. Consider it just more of the dirty work. I did my part getting them in there. Now you need to clear them out. Oh, you had to actually make sure the pests were there. Okay, yes, that's pretty revolting. Why are you doing all of this? I made the mistake of borrowing coin from Sabjorn. He's allowing me to pay it back, but he's working my fingers to the bone. Oh. He treats me like a slave. I have to do every nasty, dirty job in the metery. So a disgruntled employee. Brilliant. There's more to this than a debt, isn't there? If this plan works, not only is my debt gone, but I'll be set up for life. Mm. Maven and I worked out a little deal. If Sabjorn ends up in jail, She's going to take over his metery. And guess who gets to run the Blackbriar metery in Whiterun? Oh, yes. That... You're looking at him. I've got to admit, my first thought was as soon as this is over, Maven was going to have you killed just to tie up some loose ends. However, employing you would make you a, well, not a loose end, a stitched end. You would be a useful employee who would have to keep his mouth shut knows the business and uh yeah all round a big win oh i like this so how do i get to the brewing vats both of the buildings are connected by tunnels made by the pests infesting the metery okay there's an entrance to it in the basement storeroom of the warehouse basement that used to be boarded over okay i've already removed the boards so the metery would get infested that's where you should start <sighs> okay what about just going in through the Brewery. Well, I need to get the poison first, don't I? Sabjorn keeps that locked up tight. If you can get through that way, go right ahead. Well, I can. Oh! That would mean I don't actually have to go through the tunnels fighting rats. Yes, I like that. I do. So... Remember, Sabjorn will be needing a helping hand. Make it look good. Well, that's why I was hired. Looking good is my speciality. So once more, I must prepare for the path ahead and decide where my focus should be. I still want to keep going down the alchemy tree. Poisoner. That is not going to be very useful in the near future, though, because, you know, it's going to be a while before I go back and make some more potions. Sorry, poisons. I do want a bottomless cup, though, and I'm not too far from it. And if I don't get that now, I probably won't be able to get that next time. And that just seems so insanely useful. It really does. But, of course, insanely useful could also be used as a description for something like Infiltrator or... Sneak attack. Now, I don't imagine sneak attack is going to be that important, and seeing as I have a reason for infiltrating this place, I may not need to actually sneak around. I might need to pick the pockets of the person who owns the place to get into uh, the other building. And I do, I want to take cut purse, I really do. Although, whilst this is a good thing to have, it will make it a little easier for me to make sure I pick up keys and gold, which are probably the priorities. It's also a stepping stone to Brotherhood Cocktail, and honestly, I have to say, that's the main reason I'm uh, <laughs> loving this. That and Poisons is going to be extremely entertaining. I do require a lot more practice at pickpocket, though, so I think I've got a bit of wiggle room there. So honestly, right now, I think it's going to be Poisoner just so that I can uh, take Bottomless Cup. However, seeing as there is no actual rush, I can perhaps contemplate my way forward at a later date. Yes, indeed. Perhaps when I realize the direction my life is going to take and the uh, focus I need, I can make the decision then. Yes. So, 
Let's go and introduce ourselves and see if they need a little help. Because, of course, I am a model employee. Yes, I... Okay. Uh, why is the... Okay. Why is that not... Okay. Uh, ta-da! Oh, no. Did it all. Okay, there's it. I'm going to try that again. I'm going to pretend that did not happen. Oh. Look, I'm going to pretend that did not happen. You look strong. Come to your basker and be a companion. I'm reasonably strong, but honestly, the whole punching each other in the face until you fall over thing, not really me. Okay. Hello there. I have come to help. That's gross. Okay, let's forget what making a good at? first impression. Can't you see I have problems here? Yes, I can. Uh, but I'm here to help. At? Can't you see I have problems here? I'm here to help. Stop being annoying. Is something wrong apart from the dead rat? Are Skiba. you kidding me? Look at this place. Yes. I'm supposed to be holding a tasting of the new hunting brew reserve for the captain of the guard. Okay. If he sees the meadery in this state, I'll be ruined. <gasps> That would be terrible. I'd love to help. Yes, I would. Oh, really? And I don't suppose you'd just do it out of the kindness of your heart, would you? I hope you're not expecting to get paid until the job's done. You really are a slightly annoying person. Uh, that's the only way I operate. Yes, give, pay, pay me. Pay me now. Well, that's not how I operate, so forget it. You know what? If you don't pay me, I am going to go outside and scream, Oh my god, there's a giant rat killing everyone in there. Oh my god, it's disgusting. And then I'm going to put my fingers down my throat and I'm going to vomit everywhere. Okay, okay. No need to make rash decisions. Here's half. You get the rest when the job's done. My only demand is that these vermin are permanently eliminated before my reputation is completely destroyed. That I actually can promise that I will do. Please ignore my stomach. I am very, very sorry. Uh, how do I permanently clear the vermin? I bought some poison. I was going to have my lazy, good-for-nothing assistant, Malice, handle it. But he seems to have vanished. If you plant this in the vermin's nest, it should stop them from ever coming back. Okay, you've got a deal. Don't come back until every one of those things are dead. <laughs> okay, I... You mentioned someone named Malice. Malice is the best deal I've ever made. Lent him a bit of gold some time ago I knew he'd never be able to pay back. Nothing like free labor to make operating costs cheaper. Yeah, okay, that's, that's clever. It's a shame you're such an objectionable person. Now I've got person. to clean up this mess. Yes, you do that. <sighs> okay. Was something we discussed unclear? I'm probably not allowed to kill him. I'm, I'm almost certainly not allowed to kill him. Okay, so uh, I am heckish. So yeah, let's let's take. I'm feeling well sated. So we have got to go and poison the nest and uh, something else. Sweet roll. So we don't have a key was something we discussed un oh you know what i need earplugs for this was job something we discussed unclear are you gonna be following me okay, just oh oh those lunar moth wings those i need those aren't i wouldn't say rare but ooh, okay i can actually uh make some decent stuff out of those Right, this requires a key, and I don't have that particular key. I can't pick the lock. So the two choices are find a key or go through some tunnels infested with... Oh, what? 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 No. Seriously, he's locked me... How? Can I... Can I not knock on the door? Can I not knock on the door? Why can't I knock on... Oh, God, this... Just let me in. I'm here to do a job for you. Fine. <sighs> right. Let's just... 
He better not get aggressive when I go in there. Okay, I was just checking outside to see if there are any holes in the walls where the skeevers could come in and out. That's all I was doing. Yes, it was. Okay. We will be in here doing our poisony thing, so we're going to close the door. In you go. If you please. Right, let's look at what... Oh. Okay, steel from Hunning Brew Mead Barrel. We can take lots of mead with us if we if we want. Oh. The basement. This lock requires a key. I'm pretty sure we have the key for that. Oh god, please tell me we've got the key for that. Uh Right, so let's just have a quick look around. Lots of mead. Just generally a good store of alcohol and not a lot else by the looks of things. Potatoes. Ooh. Okay. What do we have up here? Oh, is this his... This is his bed. The Lusty Argonian Maid, Volume 2. Yes, let's ruin his night. Plus, I don't have that, so... But that's the only reason I'm taking it. I'm only taking it to annoy him and to add it to my collection. No other reason. I'm not going to read it. Not at all. No, I'm not. Okay. okay. Other bed. There does not seem... Oh. Oh. Okay. oh! Oh, I already have the key. Alright then. So, where does this go? Right. What do we have in... Okay, Sabian's dresser. This lock requires a key. Does it just? Alright. That's a little... Annoying honor among thieves, not red. We'll save it for later. Okay, you know what? We should we should start on one side and work our way around. Yes, we should. Nice. Thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. Okay, so over here we had a display case with nothing in it. And a letter to Sabjorn. Sabjorn, this is my third and final offer. I feel that I've been more than generous with the amounts I've stated to buy your meadery. There is no reason for competition to stifle both of our businesses. Unified, we could make Blackbriar Mead a household name and bury anyone else who tries to start a similar business in Skyrim. If you wish to accept my offer, please come to Riften and stay at my manor as a guest. I think you'll find that being part of the Blackbriar family would be both lucrative and life-saving. Yes, you should have remembered that last bit. I'm going to leave this letter here. I actually don't want to make it too obvious that we've uh, robbed the place. Hopefully he will get carted off before he can do an inventory check. So, right, here we go. Let's see what's through there. I should definitely turn the light off, shouldn't I? So yeah, I mean, I mean, as long as it doesn't look like there's someone been robbed here, he'll never even know. But if things like the letter are missing, maybe someone will spot it. Silver. Okay, Hunning Brew Decanter. Okay, coin purse, silver medallion, silver bullions. Don't mind if I do. And the hunting brew decanter. You know, I was going to say that's for del delving. All right, so. Ooh. Cunningly hidden. Did I check the end table? Yes, probably. Right. Now. Okay, that's not. I've still not found a key for next door, which, okay, 
Nice. Nice. Also nice. Yeah, I've, I've, I've not found a key. Which is slightly annoying. Am I missing something? I don't think so. There, there was a sort of suggestion, wasn't there? There was a suggestion that there might be another way in. And it was locked. It did require... Oh, God, do you think... I've already checked in there. Do you think he uh, has the key on him? Probably. I should have gone and uh, checked that. I may check it before I go anywhere. Oh, well. Okay. Still? Okay, let's cl oh, let's close doors. Close the door. I want it to look relatively uh, undisturbed. He's got a bottle of beer at his bed. Okay, come on. Come on, out you go. I want to I lock this door. Not lock it. Clo I should be able to lock doors again, shouldn't I? Yes, I should. I should be able to lock doors and uh, make it look like I've never, ever been. Nothing here. Damn it. That is marginally annoying. Because... Honestly, I'm not sure it's a good idea to pick pockets on him. I'm really not. Okay. Oh, no, wait, wait. Okay, so. We've checked the premises. It's, uh, we're, we're just doing, we're checking this room. I'm a professional. I've done this before, believe it or not. And, um, you know, I'm uh, just uh, making sure I can't see any skeever spores. Lying around, just, you know. Okay, now, I don't think there is one. I do not think... I am not... If there is one, I'm not seeing it. Oh. Okay. Fine. That's annoying. All right. Was something we discussed on <sighs> I probably... I'm probably missing something monumentally obvious. Yes, I am. However, unless it becomes even more obvious than it was before. <sighs> We're going in the rat tunnels, basically. I should be used to this by now. Okay. Skeever. Is it coming for you or me? I think it was me. What was that? Okay, I... Th Ooh, skeever tail. Actually, you know what? Okay. Maybe this will turn out to be fairly lucrative. Oh! Oh, God. Oh, these are... Okay. They're not. We are they? Okay. Venom? This is what we were born to do. Depressing. Yeah. Little. I'd much rather be in a palace relieving young ladies of old artifacts. Yes, indeed. Or even old ladies of young artifacts, you know what? Expand your mind. Okay, that went a place I really did not intend to go. Uh, moving on. Um, I'm just, I'm putting it away, I'm putting it away, I am putting it away. Right, so, we need to find... ...a nest. Okay. For some odd reason, they just look like something you should jam in your arm. Okay. Yeah, I don't know, like like a needle you would jam in your arm. Don't ask why. Probably something from another life. Okay. So. Ooh. Can we just activate these traps and lure something? Towards us, or should we just um take it nice and easy? 
problem is, is I can't see if there's a trap at my feet. Okay. Did I hear something? No. Somebody lit a... Oh, right, no, it's the guy that's been leading the rats to, uh, to this place. Yes, it is. Good grief. Yes, the torch is actually still a little better for this sort of thing, isn't it? Did I see something move? Possibly. Okay. I thought I saw a trap. I thought I saw a trap. This is where I'm going to step right... Oh my god. This is ridiculously dark. Somebody's been drinking down here. You know what? I think I think we'll keep the uh, the lantern for uh, well for for a different moment. This is a moment for a torch. Yes, it is. Uh, okay, path goes this way. So there's just an awful lot of mead down here. That's actually reasonably valuable, you know. And it's not stolen. I can sell that to anyone. Hmm. Okay. Maybe I'll start going into the uh, alcohol trade. Shh. Can you hear that? That does not sound like rats. That sounds like spiders. Yes, it does. Okay. Ah! It, it's spiders. It's spiders. Right. Okay. okay. Silly spider. Oh, it's a big spider. Did you say incy wincy spider? I, I couldn't quite tell. Another textbook example of skill and grace. Thank you very much. Or did you mean yourself? I mean, I can't quite tell. Um. Oh, poison. It's not a great poison, but it's a poison. And I'm a little low on poisons right now. Yes, I am. Okay. Did I hear a no, no? Okay. So. Oh, it's another spider. And it's dead. We didn't get that far, did we? Okay. Those things are rolling by themselves, and that spider is still moving. Okay, it's not moving anymore. Okay. Oh, can I get to that? No. However. Nice. Uh. Oh, there, there, there it is. It's not always easy to find where to pick these. It's like a little... Uh, I think you have to look at the tendrils... Was that you eating? That was you eating, wasn't it? You did. You, you made a sound that was a little creepy, considering we're in a spider-infested cave. Please don't sound like an arachnid, if you can possibly help it. Okay, let's continue. And, uh... Stay with the stealthy thing. Okay. Another skeleton. Hmm. 
What do you think? More spiders? What did that sound like? That sounded... I don't know what that sounded like, to be honest. You don't think there's anything else here, do you? Okay, no, that sounds like... Mammalian feet. You're feeling a bit fatigued. Okay, yes, oh, that's a good point. It has been a while since I slept. <laughs> intuition saves the day. Yeah, I shouldn't do that. You should never claim intuition when you, you just guess something correctly because of all the times you guess it incorrectly and then promptly forget that you did it and then become completely convinced that your intuition is infallible. Selective memory. Amazing thing. Very dangerous. I see another. Okay, what's it going to drop? Oh, I see a chain. Oh, it's one of those. Okay, um. Yes. Spiky ball to the face. That looks like a gap. Okay, never mind. What on earth would set a trap like this? I mean... I mean, was it our guy? If so, he could have warned me. Definitely, definitely skeevers. Yes, indeed. This lantern is really nice. Yes, it is. And... Okay. I'm hearing at least two. Are you hearing two? I'm hearing at least two. Two, but I think it's just Skeever. Yes, I do. Can't. Can't see a damned thing. All right. Let's just go and play with the Skeever. I guess. It's. There it, it is. No, that's good. That's ah. Oh, God. What the f- I'm sorry. What just happened? Okay, I'm having an odd premonition that one of these skeevers is going to fireball us in the face. Did I trigger a trap? Okay. That was very, very odd. Okay. Yeah, maybe you want to go first, Inigo? See what's there for us? Okay, he seems a little aggressive. I'm, I'm actually okay with that. You know what? I think I want the torch. At least I can see a bit further now. Uh, you're kind of in the way. Oddly enough. Uh, actually, no. I don't want to make you wait somewhere. I will attack on sight. There's a schema there. Now is the time to attack on sight. Okay. Is that the one with the fireball? No. Okay. Really? When did skeevers get fireballs? 
Well, it was only a premonition. I suppose I suppose that could have been a bad dream. I suppose. Seems a little odd. I'm getting a creepy feeling right now. Are you? We're in a big open cave. Uh, wait. Am I hearing a mortar and pestle? Is it pestle or pestle? You know what? I think it might be time. It might be time to uh, put. There's a guy there. There's a guy there. Right there. Right. You know what? I have a premonition that that's a mage. And I actually have a nice po po poison of damage magicka, but it damages more than just magicka. It damages health. It stops manage. Well, it damages your magicka regeneration. Oh, this weapon is already poisoned. Okay, damn it. Fine, let's do that one. Yeah, it does damage to. Where the hell is he? Oh, there's a skeever there. What I wanted to do was creep up on him and kill him with a single thrust. But there is a skeever right there. I honestly think I want you to stay here. I want to control this situation. Yes, I do. I'm going to whistle now, and I'm hoping it's one of those whistles that only you can hear. Okay, do not take too long. Where is that skeever? Sort of... I wonder if I should give you a command to just shoot that thing with a bow. I wish I had a bow. Why didn't I bring a bow? Why have I not brought a bow? I brought arrows. I need a crossbow. You know what? You know what? Now is the time. Yes, it is. How long? 26. 26. Right. Anything else? Plentiful healing, fortified. Right. Okay. You know, that's invisible. I'm invisible. I'm invisible. Let's try to get close to the rat and kill it. What was that? Oh, sh... Oh! Oh, my... I'm not sure how we're going to do this, other than very, very, very carefully. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take an invisibility potion. And then I'm going to send you to attack the mage to get everyone's attention. And I'm just going to run in and whack him. Stay right there. I see the skeever. I, I, if I get you to attack, would you sneak attack? Would you sneak attack them? That would be ridiculously useful. Yes, it would. All right, damage magic of regents, another one. All right, I'm gonna put that on here. I'm gonna save everything for the mage. I'm gonna take invisibility and then I'm gonna send you forward to attack. Yes, I am. All right. Okay. Okay. I will be more aggressive. No, no, that's not. That's not what I wanted. I actually wanted to. Nope. Exercising restraint. Yeah. No, sorry. My bad. My bad. I want to look down. Name it, and I will do my best. I want you to attack the skeever. Can you shoot it with your bow? I will do as you ask. While I get the hell out of the way, so I don't get seen. Nope. You're gonna go with your sword. I did tell you you could. Haven't you attacked it yet? Did you? Okay. Right, 
I need more invisibility. No, no, no. I've got him with. Oh, for the love of John. Oh. Let's do this quickly and quietly. Give me your butt. Oh, you don't have a butt. Uh, oh, right. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. So. Um. Mind if I ask you something? I need you to. Mind if I ask you something? What is it? It's about your combat. What needs work? Um, I want you... I am adaptable. That's very good. I want you to use bow. Okay, when sounds good to me. Yes. Right, okay. So Following. Good. Right. Dude. Oh, God. Here goes. Right. Uh, actually, why don't I... Do something like that so I can get this done pretty quickly, right? I want you to shoot. What is the plan? Shoot this guy. I will do as you ask. Shoot it. Shoot it. Shoot it. Shoot it. You've got him. Huh? Are you an idiot? Alright. Uh, in you go. Retreat. 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 Okay? Definitely retreat, retreat, retreat. Uh, okay, this is a skip. I want to, I want to kill the skip. Here to go. Whoa! 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 Okay, okay, okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hey, I'm here in a boat. I'm here in a boat. I'm here in a boat. Is that one dead? That one's dead. That one is dead. That one is... Ah! Oh, uh, fire! Ow! Uh, okay. Okay. Hamelin? Who the hell is Hamelin? Right. Damage. Magic. Right. No, no, no. I could take your blindfolded. Well, I tell you what. Then take your blindfold off and get him. He's right there, dude. Are you shooting him with an arrow? That works for me. That works for me. Whoa! Get him! Shoot him in the back! I'm drawing his fire! I'm drawing his fire! Which is a fancy way of saying I'm dancing in and out! Okay, hello, hi. Are you gonna. Wow! Oh! Oh! God! Uh, no, uh, right. Uh, fortify hell. Do I have. Do I have. Oh, no, I don't have a regeneration one. There's a guy behind you! What the f Okay, you, you're shooting him. I can see you're shooting him. His health's going down. He's focusing on me. Holy sh... Ow! I'm on fire! God! How about invisible again? Invisible! I'm invisible! I'm invisible! I'm not here. I'm not here. Focus on... Inigo! I was just saying, focus on me... 